Welcome to Wildlife Wednesday. If you were looking for bats in Montana, where would you look? Probably a cave, right? But that's not the only place you can find them in Montana. Let's talk to our local bat expert and he'll help us find some bats. A lot of people think bats live in caves. While that might be true in the wintertime, summer roosting sites are very different. And a lot of the crevice roosting bats, which are the majority of bats in Montana, will find cracks and crevices in rock faces, just like this one. They can get in there, they can feel safe from predators, they can be protected from weather events, and they can take advantage of all the thermal properties that rocks provide. Here we are under a bridge, and bridges are examples of man-made structures where bats can find habitat. And in this case here, we're talking about night roosting habitat where bats can um, find a safe place to get out of the wind, out of the weather, digest their meal. One thing about bridges is they tend to be close to water and water is a place where bats like to feed because there are a lot of insects. You can see signs of bats occupying this site. There is guano, there is urine staining, and there are piles of guano underneath the areas where they roost. This might surprise you, but some crevice roosting bats will look for trees just like this one. Old snags that have died and the bark is peeling away from the trunk. And bats can get in between the bark and the trunk and thermoregulate to their desired temperature by crawling around the tree trunk in this crevice. So this is an example of an artificial roost site or what we call bat houses. Each one of these bat houses can hold hundreds of bats. And these are placed perfectly. They're faced southeast, so the first light of the day hits these bat boxes. And they're also placed on a brick building. And brick absorbs a lot of solar radiation, a lot of heat, and releases it slowly throughout the evening. So this is the perfect setup for an artificial roost site. One way to tell if bats are using it is to look up inside during the day. Another way to tell if bats are using this bat house is to look beneath the house itself. You'll see bat guano. Well, who knew bats lived in all these different places from cracks and crevices and rocks to bridges, inside tree bark, to maybe even in a bat house that you could build. Thanks for coming to Wildlife Wednesday.